911. Where's your emergency? This is Alec Murdoch at 4147 Moselle Road. I need the police to stand this immediately. My wife and child have been shot badly. Okay, you said 4147 Moselle Road in Allison? Sir? You said 4147 Moselle Road in Allison? Yes, sir. 4147 okay. Moselle Road. Stay on the line with me, okay? Hurry. Yes, sir. Stay on the line with me, okay? <laughs> Hello? I'm still here. Stay on the line. I'm still here, okay? Oh. Collison, I have an Alex Murdoch on the line. Caller from 4147 Moselle Road. He's advising that his wife and child was shot. Mr. Murdoch, go ahead and talk to Collison. It's 4147. Moselle Road, I've been up to it now. It's bad. Okay. Okay. Con County Communication. Collison, I have an Alex Murdoch on the line. Call us from 4147 Moselle Road. He's advising that his wife and child was shot. Okay, and sir, give me the address again. It's 4147 Moselle Road. I've been up to it now. It's bad. Okay. Oh. Okay, and are they breathing? No, ma'am. Okay, and you said it's your wife and your son? My wife and my son. Are they in a vehicle? No, ma'am. They're on the ground out at my kennel. <laughs> okay, and did you see anyone? Okay, is he breathing at all? No, no. Is she? Okay, do you see anything? Do you see anyone in the area? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. What color is your house on the outside? What color is your house on the outside? Uh, it's white. You can't see it from the road. Okay. Is it a house or a mobile home? It's a house. Okay. And what is your name? My name is Alec Murdoch. Okay, and did you hear anything, or did you come home and find them? No, man, I've been gone. I, I just came back. <laughs> okay, and was anyone else supposed to be at your house? No, ma'am. <laughs> Please hurry. We're getting somebody out there to you. Oh. Oh. Okay, what is her name? Mag Maggie and Paul. Maggie is her name? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And please hurry. <laughs> uh, we're getting somebody out there to you. Me asking you these questions. Don't slow them down, okay? And you sure they're not breathing? Is he moving at all, your son? I know you said that she was shot, but what about your son? <laughs> Nobody. They're not. Neither one of them's moving. What is your telephone number? And does anything look out of place? Ma'am, I, I not not particularly, really, no, ma'am. Okay. Okay. All right, I'm going back down there.
Hold it close, ma'am. Yeah, they're, they've been en route with you ever since uh, you got on the phone with me. I have multiple people coming out there to you. Okay, can you do me a favor, Mr. Murdoch, and turn on the flashers on your car so that way they can see where the kennels are? Do you have your flashers on for me, Mr. Murdoch? Yes. Okay. I don't want you to touch them at all, okay? I don't I don't know if you've already touched them, but I don't I don't want you to touch them just in case they can get any kind of evidence, okay? Uh, I I already touched them trying to get a um to see if they were breathing. Okay. Well, I I just don't want you to move anything just in case they can get any kind of evidence, okay? Ma'am, I'm going to call. I, I need to call some of my family. Okay. Well, well, do me a favor for me. Whenever you see the officer or the medics, because they're, they're all coming to you. Absolutely. Okay. But we have them come in. Turn on the flashes on your vehicle so they can see you, okay? You got the flashes on for me? I do. Okay. All right. Just whenever you see them. Okay. How old is your son? Twenty-two. Okay. All right. Okay. We're we're getting them out there to you. Okay. Footage seen by the jury earlier in the trial shows a highly emotional Alec Murdoch sobbing yards away from his murdered wife and son. They did check him. Yes, sir. It's official that they're dead. It's bad. Check the pulses. The court also released Alex's second police interview. It was just so bad. They did it so bad. 